everybody. So today I'm going to do a review and brief tutorial on the P-Touch Embellished by Brother. What makes this label maker different from the rest is it's kind of geared towards the crafters. It's sold exclusively at Michael's. Um, and it prints on ribbons. So here is an example of some of the ribbons that you can get. Um, they come in some different colors. There's like red, blue, white, pink, and they're really nice. I'll show some examples later on in the video. Um, they're about $10. This was $60, and I used a 60% coupon, and I got it for like $23, which I probably wouldn't have paid the $60 because I don't print on ribbon. I don't plan on doing it that much, but it's a great feature to have on a $23 machine. Um, here are some of the tapes that I also picked up for it. They're decorative tapes. However, you can use the regular TZE tapes. It will take different widths and sizes. Um, and there's also, I'll put on the link on Amazon, there's some off-market brands that will fit in this machine that are a lot cheaper. These tapes are $10 a piece. Um, you, I mean, obviously, if you're at Michael's, you can use the coupon, so they can probably, you know, use a 50% coupon. You're going to pay 5 bucks, 40% coupon, $6. Uh, I had the Tepperlite washi, and I did return it and got this one instead because that one was like 80 and even with the 60% off, I didn't really like the tapes that they sold with it, and you could only use the washi tapes that came with it. Um, I like this because it's more versatile, um, but they are kind of similar. So it does a lot. There's a lot of fonts and a lot of different things you can do with this. It does come with a sample cartridge. It's not very long. I don't know if it says how many feet it is, but it's it's a pretty short. I don't think it's going to last very long. It's uh, white with the gold, um, and I didn't even open it. There's a template if you're French. I'm not sure what this is about, but in if you speak French, they have a special template. And then they have the instruction sheet. Now this instruction sheet... Um, has a lot of information and it's something you definitely want to hang on to. Um, so it'll tell you how to, you know, put the batteries in. It takes six AAA batteries. I'll open up the compartment and, you know, it gives you a description of a lot of the settings, the supplies, accessories, um, how to enter the different texts and how to do the ribbons and tells you how to do a lot of different things. This has a lot. I mean, it does a lot. You can do up to two lines. Um, there are a lot of different fonts. It, you can do a lot of different languages. There are some shortcuts, some troubleshooting, and then you have um, kind of like a template for all your different um, symbols and what it offers you. There's different symbols, there's fonts, there's marks that you can do, a lot of different frame designs. There's even some like patterns you can print out. You can do it continuous form. Um, you even can accent your characters. And then here down here again is more of the frame designs. Uh, there's 96 frame designs. There are um, 20 different versions of the continuous form. There's 25 patterns. There's a lot of characters. Um, in different ways to do, um, you have templates that you can switch your writing upside, you know, different ways that you can do that. So I'm going to try to get this. Um, the biggest problem I have is so that you can actually see the screen. Um, so here we go. It does have memory and there are, you can save files in here. Um, so the last thing I did was this, um, I'll show you. I did a quick little thing for my dog on the tape and I will show you. Um, so this is what was on the screen now. I was playing around with it and I put like a border and I can put some pictures in here and that is on the tape. And then here are some, um, of the ribbons. This is a continuous ribbon. I do it with my son's Christian's name on it. I did another tape with my name on it. And here is a pattern tape. Um, the blue this is really pretty, um, the blue, I hope it shows up. I did another one that is, um, it's the light, here we go, uh, that I added in with like a little sewing machine and a little Paris border, just playing around with the different borders, different fonts. Uh, here is a really cool, like, happy birthday one I did. Gotta catch, like, the lighting in here just right. So this is a really cute little happy birthday one. Let's quickly kind of go and show you how to do it. There is, um, I think it's Bible scraps. She's, I'll put a link down. She does, um, 
she does a like four part tutorial on just using the machine on how to change your margin so you're not wasting the tape and a lot of different stuff so I'll put that in here um, so it, when you turn it on it's going to come up as the last thing you can just kind of um, hit OK and you can kind of back space it to clear it out and then say I want to put say congratulations um, I just type that in and I can hit OK um, I can change the frame around it I have these stars right now but I can change it um, and you can kind of see the preview of them I'll try to move it so there's no glare. Um, you can hit OK. If you pick it, it says it accepted. Congratulations. I can also put in, let's see, a symbol. So if I wanted to do, let's see, a pictograph, I would say OK. Um, then there's different categories. So I'm going to do like animals. Um, let's do decorative. I'm going to hit OK. I just scroll through the different ones. There's like a half moon. I'm going to hit OK. And then I can do like a preview. It'll show me how it looks. Um, I can scroll through how it's going to look. It shows me everything that's in there, the borders or everything that I have in there. I hit OK. Um, and then I can just hit print. It'll ask me how many copies I want. Sorry for the glare. OK, so how many copies I want. I'm going to hit OK for one copy and then it's going to print this out on this purple here hit the button and here is my congratulations tape now let me change it out so when you want to change it you just open the back again there is okay I can it's super simple you just pop the tape out I'm going to put in this white ribbon tape in here. Um, there's like a little, shows you right there how to put it in. There's really only one way for it to go. It takes six AAA batteries. Um, it also has a port though if you have the AC adapter or you can buy one or use one that you have to work. All right, so I'm going to do a new one. I'm going to clear it out and I want to do a whole new one. I'm going to type my name. So I'm going to do G. I, uh, let's see if I can do lowercase. So I'm going to hit sh shift I and A um, so that I can have it lowercase. I'm going to hit OK. I'm going to go into font because I want to change the style. So um, you can do the style, the alignment, the font, um, size, the width. I'm going to change the style. So I'm going to hit OK. Uh, outline, shadow, I think I'm going to try a shadow, maybe I'll do out like a solid, italic, bold, outline, italic plus shadow, let's try that one, I'm going to hit OK. So maybe I want to do um, a, a frame, so I'm going to hit frame, and I'm just going to scroll through the frames, I or I, I can scroll through the frames or I can just pick a frame. Uh, let me just type in, this one's kind of cute, let me type in 25, so I'm going to hit in 25, and then I can still scroll through them, I'll hit OK, I'm going to hit Preview, there we go, I'm going to hit Print, it's going to ask me how many copies I want, I hit, use this button to pop it off, and now I just printed out my label my ribbon with my name um, so yeah so here are a bunch of like um, different different ones that you have that it can do I mean it's very versatile like I said I wouldn't use this um I probably wouldn't have paid the sixty dollars but I think definitely if you use a coupon for the twenty two dollars that it costs if you need you know it's definitely definitely worth that kind of um, investment I think all right, well, I hope you enjoyed this review. Thanks for watching and have a great day.